Okay, something hilarious just happened. Hello, we're on the car starting a road trip to North Carolina, a place called Tryon Resort, which is near Lake Lua. We're going for an equestrian event, which we're very excited about because we uh, haven't done that before. What's going on? We can stand and it looks really cool and there's an upstairs. Oh, let's go and see what it's like. <gasps> Sleeping. No, it's our sleeping. Yeah. yeah, it's like we have we a little play area here. <laughs> cool, big mattress, bed, windows. <laughs> nice, guys. Our own loft. And, oh, you're up there. We have our own loft because it's like a loft. And then Where are like you guys? Where are you? A mattress. Oh, there. there you are. We've arrived at the Tryon Resort, which is part of the Tryon International Equestrian Centre. And later on this year, they will be hosting the World Equestrian Games. So we're here to check it out and uh, see the fun of the equestrian and show you guys what an awesome family experience that it is. And this centre has been created to allow families and people of all ages and lifestyles to appreciate the magic of the horses and the wonderful events that you can have with them. So we're excited to participate in this this weekend and check it out. It's our first time, so I think it's going to be lots of fun. I know when I was young going to the Easter show in Sydney, I used to love going and checking out the equestrian event. So I'm excited and we're staying in this lovely cabin at the resort. So on site they have um, accommodation lodging facilities as well. So you just over the way there is the actual equestrian center, which we're going to check out in a very short while. We'll see you over there. We can watch the horses while we're eating lunch, which is really cool. So at Tryon uh, Equestrian Centre there are lots of different choices uh, to eat so we hope to try a few of them to show you while we're here but the Mexican Cantina was recommended to us as a delicious place to eat and cheap and it is really cheap. It's only a few dollars for Calaris quesadilla and I think seven dollars for our taco bowl so that's really awesome. And you get to watch the horses, this is really cool. We're watching the Cus Crunchy. World Equestrian Games 2018. People or horses? Horses. <laughs> what did you just learn about The it? officials for the competition again. I Andrew don't Abeni here from New Zealand. He's presiding over the jury for the competition at the three star level. He's joined by Jane Hamlet from the United States. What do you think of the jump? technical delegate, uh, Mark Leva here from Germany. He's an assistant from Brazil. <laughs> and a piece of. Marcelo okay. Pereira. And these tiny, Deputy veterinary tiny delegate is Dr. Jennifer Hall, big jumps, uh, associate like. veterinarian Dr. Debbie right. Williamson. It's going to be fun. So we're waiting for Andrew Hoy, the very famous Australian Olympic gold medalist, three times in one silver, to come riding past so we can get some shots of him. So fingers crossed we can grab him right now. We're going to enjoy a mimosa and a delicious lunch. Oh, you sure? Yeah, yeah. I need exercise. Okay. 
quick break here at the cabin before we go and check out some vaulting, more gymnastics on horses. I'm awesome. I'm Did you love the um, cross country event? Yeah, it was fun, wasn't it? It was interesting. It's our first time we've ever done anything like that. It was a great atmosphere. It got warm. We had nice food. We had mimosas and we had an Aussie jumping. You had mimosas. And we had fun. Where are you in the spinning teacup? Why are you on a horse? <laughs> Hello, Ra. Something you want to say? We're going to stay on the horse and You're going to stay on all night, are you? <laughs> over time to head to the silo for an afternoon beverage <laughs> good place did you love it yeah I want to go again let's come back when it's uh, night time and then it'd be night cooler ride. it'd be cool why does it make right it night oh, cool. a couple hours it's we'll come after white. dinner I wonder how she wants to do the bears, bars you want to do the bars again she's mad on the jump and she might be a show jumper go way up <laughs> Cheers from the Silo Bar at the Tryon International Equestrian Centre. We're having a local beer from the Highland Brewing Company in Asheville. Counting Crows. Ah, yes, Counting Crows. Good music, good vibes, and nice weather. cross-country and vaulting events with a lovely breakfast at Roger Diners which is here on site. Huevo Rancheros and Craig went for the healthy start. Oh and the kids, look at this, sharing uh, chocolate chip pancakes only because it's a special event. Afternoon, watching the show, jumping. The girls are loving it. <laughs> it's uh, just such a nice, relaxing sport to watch. Chiropractors, massage therapists, spas, acupuncture. 
positive people and yeah. Acupuncture and they're beautifully groomed and well cared for and loved, don't they? Yeah, they and they come. like doing the sport. They love it, don't they? Do you know do you remember why we learnt they love doing the sport? Because horses are really competitive. Um. <laughs> And they love to showcase how wonderful they are. Isn't that wonderful? That's a great lesson for all of us to learn, to showcase how wonderful you are. Look at them, they're just gorgeous. So as you can see, this is a fun place to be for families. There's lots of cool things for kids. They've got the pretend show jumping and a carousel that is free. And they have uh, a thing called Saturday Night Lights where it's free for everyone to come and carousel and pony rides and just experiencing the joy of this equestrian uh, event. So it's cool, we're gonna go and check out the vaulting now, which is gymnastics on horses. The girls are gonna love this. to celebrate the fork event this weekend that we're here to see and it is in the um, Legends Club so you can um, buy tables here during the season the equestrian season and so you have these amazing views out to the main arena so you can sit here with your food and your drinks and watch the show out there there's no show on tonight but tomorrow morning we're gonna have brunch here and there will be show jumping so I'm looking forward to sitting here at Legends Club and experiencing it right now we've got a band playing as you can hear awesome music and we got a lovely dinner and a glass of wine the kids have got their juices and we might get up and dance in a minute but we're just gonna kick back and enjoy the what the fork party at the Tryon International Equestrian Center Starting off our last day here at the Equestrian Centre with brunch in Legends Club where we were last night and we have amazing views over the main arena to watch the show jumping. Uh, we're pretty excited because Andrew Hoy is coming up next um, and we just get these amazing views and the girls are absolutely loving it and this is why we're on this journey in America, America Unplugged to discover incredible things like these, things that you wouldn't think of when you go to plan a trip and um, a way to sort of get involved with the local communities and see the way they live, see what's important to them and uh, discover unique festivals and events. You can hear they're getting ready for them to come out now. Um, but yeah, we're, we're really excited to experience this as a family. Uh, we discovered something new that we enjoy and can do more of as we travel. Who'd have thought that having fun time at an equestrian event would be something we'd enjoy as a family, but we've really loved it. The center has been amazing. Um, it's, it's just what has been created here is incredible, and it's the vision of one man that's been put together to bring equestrian eventing uh, to the masses and make it accept, a accessible uh, to anyone, particularly families. So um, yeah, this has been really cool. We've loved it a lot. Yeah, you love it that 201. much? <laughs> Do you love it? In 2020, when the hotels are built. Yeah, when the five-star hotel is built so we can go in it. You want to stay in the five-star hotel? Yeah. Yeah, because they're your building, kind of style? like, all down there and around here. Wait, they're building a million Put the camera stuff. down. Hang on, wait a minute. And, and there's going to be, um, 
It's going to be like a five star hotel up there with driveways coming up and staircases. It's going to be awesome. And there's going to be hotels all down there. Wait, and there's going to be. I think so. Said. That's what yes. the lady said. And then there's going to be like. No, don't, don't there's going to be like grassy water fountains in between it or something. It's going to be awesome, isn't it? Huge plans in the world. And there's going to be more, but I just forgot. But it looks good. Yeah.